Hello, welcome back to Matt's Coins, where we're going to finish off going through the last of bag four and its five kilo contents of mixed coinage. We have already found um, a bit of silver. You know, in terms of, I think we've got what one, two. This is all the silver that we found so far. Uh, what's that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different silver coins. Hopefully, there's a few more in here. In fact, I'm getting drawn to these two. Well, that one. 25 cents. That's going to be Q for nickel, so that's not. But there's a 1936 pence there. Just poured out and sitting on the top. I'm just looking over as well. Another 10 cents. Looks to be 1952. So, you know, there's still hope for a few more bits of silver as we go through. And then there's this. I just picked it up off the top of the pile. Either somebody's had a go at colouring that in, or they've managed to weigh... Oh, weigh. Uh, managed to force in, uh, you know, cut out the back and force in by filing or whatever another type of coin. That is actually does actually feel quite heavy. I might come back to that. Anyway, enough of that. And there's more silver. Mm, we're gonna get a date. Nineteen twenty-four. Yeah, nineteen twenty-four. Nineteen twenty-four sixpence there. We'll add that to the uh, the silver pile. Whilst these coins are not don't pay for the lot themselves. They certainly help with the collection, that's for sure. Ten euro cents there from Spain. Nineteen forty-four. There's two reverses, all to do with the position of the four in relation to the wave above. If you've watched this series, you'd have heard me harp on about it. Same with the the gap on the 21 penny. If you're just tuning in for the first time and you've never seen one of my hunts, I would suggest that you go back and have a look through the playlists. Um, and certainly, maybe start at the beginning of this particular hunt. We have 10 drachma, 500 lira, so this is a more modern one, because if you remember we got the silver version there as well. Looking for a 46 or a 49, got a 1990 Denver there, 37. This is Switzerland 10. I can't remember the exact phrase, was it? Not Hellas, no, that's a different currency. 1966. It's a 1939 penny, and we've got another 10p. 68. 1917, 61, and 67 thruppence, a little one fennig piece. Five new P from uh, 1980. We've got five euro cents. Not really sure where it's fun. Oh, yeah, that'll be Germany then. 
to 1960. 1919, looking for that mint mark as always, not there. Looking for the 64, 65 in the, the sixpences. 1949, 1967, that's going to be a 67, yep. There's a 57, a 42, a 1994 Denver minted cent. Drop one. Nineteen thirty six. Nineteen fifty seven. Nineteen sixty four. Here we go. Right. Okay. Looking at the second eight. This is obverse three because the A is to the gap. So we're looking for that in the 1965 coins or the obverse 4 in the 1964 again it's to the gap here we go 42 again 1916 is your recessed era course that isn't Time 2015 Philadelphia. Just dropped 1943 Here we go. 1939. 1965 with a nice cut. And there's a couple of Elizabeth ones to finish off that little bit. Shiny 66. Nineteen sixty five, two shillings. 1917, as I've said before, no real varieties on the 17s. That's another 17. Nineteen twenty-one. Look at that gap. 1940, single. 1940, you got your single and your double leg zerg line. There's a 62. Nineteen forty five always on the lookout for the double nine. Nineteen sixty six time. A couple of years eight from it being the silver variety. So nineteen seventy S minted San Francisco minted scent there. Nineteen seventy Denver. Nickel. This is 64, 67, and a 67. 62, sixpence, uh, fourpence. And a 1939. Okay, we've got another dime. 1989 Denver that time. There's a 27 penny. There's a 44. 
1910. Okay, we've got a quarter from 1965. And you can see there that it is the clad variety. If it had been a year earlier, that would have probably been so. Well, it would have been silver. Close, but no cigar. Ten pennig. 1943 fruppence, 63, 64, 50 Fennig from Germany, 45 again, we'll be looking at the nines on these, 67 and a 43. Right, into the last couple of handfuls, so this will see out this particular video. I will then go and start the long laborious task of going for all of these coins. Looking for any of the varieties on the on the copper, seeing what adds to or upgrades my own albums. I don't hold up for many upgrades to the Whitman albums. But certainly my collection will benefit from some of the well, definitely benefit from the silver content. It would be nice to find the elusive 46 and the 49 in these last few coins. I don't see it happening though. Nineteen fourteen. oops. 61, 63, come on then, come on then George. And it's another 44. Seven, half penny, nineteen forty-four halfpenny, sixty-five penny, Oops. forty-three fruppence, fifty-six, forty-three, fifty-eight, fifty-six. Come on, George. Forty-two. Come on. Could be a 46 with that reverse, uh, obverse, sorry. 49 it would have got rid of in the nymp. But it's a measly 43. And a couple more. Elizabeth ones. 52. So you can see there where Oops, if I can get them on my fingers properly. We've gone from having Ind Imp, Emperor of India, to uh, with FD before it, to Fiddy Def, actually spelt out. So we have one more opportunity to get one of the key dates, and it's a 44. 67. So last few coins now. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification icon as well. So it's a little aluminium 10 lira. Um, yeah, get notified. Leave me a comment. Let me know. Uh, don't forget, I'm also, um, if you like this channel and like the content, want to keep it going, you can buy me a beer on Buy Me a Coffee. The link will be in the description. Um, other than that, with the last remaining coins, I would like to say thank you for watching. Keep an eye on uh, on the channel because there will be a wrap up session where I go through all the finds of note, um, anything interesting, that sort of thing uh, in a future video. But you know, I'd like to say thank you for watching.